Hi, this is Matt Kuntz. I'm the executive director of NAMI Montana, and we're providing a little bit of update on what happened in the Montana legislature, some of the wins, some of the not so wins. Um, and this one is about House Bill 557, which provides funding for mental health crisis services from the c cannabis tax. Um, this bill was put forward by Representative Jen Carlson out of Gallatin County, and it was one of the most important bills of the session for us. Um, Montana's crisis bed system has imploded over the last couple of years. You know, it's just everywhere, and it's been heartbreaking because people just don't have a place to go uh, when they're in crisis. Crises haven't gone away. Just the ability to have places to bring people to has just dissolved in so many parts of our state. So this bill was essential. Uh, we had believed before that hard account money would be spent for crisis services. That wasn't understood clearly. So this bill said absolutely definitively crisis beds will be supported by marijuana taxes. Like, no question ever again, this is where we're going to get some of the funding. And that's important because these rates need to be sufficient for our community providers to be able to deliver the care that they need, to be able to safely set up crisis centers and manage them with the staff that they need. These are life-saving services and we need to reimburse them like that because you know, in the past five or ten years we've tried cut rate reimbursements as a state for crisis services and it's just failed and it's failed and it's failed and our families and our communities have suffered for it so we're really grateful to Representative Carlson for putting her will behind this bill, for putting her vision behind this bill. She was an absolute force all the way through the legislature. I think it was a total of seven no votes, which if you're acquainted with the math, that's amazing because you got to do 100 votes, 100 votes, 50 votes, 50 votes, 20 votes, 20 votes. So out of all of those only seven people the entire way through, some of them more than once voted no. And we are really grateful, really hopeful for what's gonna come out of this bill. And Montana needs it, our families need it. So we're so thankful to Representative Carlson, Governor's Office, everybody that supported this bill and hopefully we can get real tangible reimbursement rates to help us rebuild community crisis care around Montana. Thank you so much.